Good morning, friends. It's day four of my California return, this running back adventure, and I'm about to hit my favorite bench in all the world. I am back in my old home of Fullerton, California, and this bench, and this vista, gosh, so much history here. Four years ago, I sat on this bench and looked out over this amazing lookout, and I shot the book trailer for Struggle Central right here. But beyond the book trailer, I mean, this spot and this park, this lookout, so much history and so much personal significance. I feel like everywhere I've, I've lived or spent a significant amount of time, I've always found my spot, you know, that special place I went to to retreat and get away and journal and pray, and this is it for Fullerton. And this park, this was actually my final, <laughs> my final resting place before I hit the road on my running to adventure. I remember that evening so vividly, May 31st, 2014. I came here, I journaled, I wrote a letter to myself to be open in the future, and then I went to my car, turned the key, and hit the road. Coming here today, I actually parked in the same <laughs> parking spot that I had Mitzi in the last time I was here, before I left on the road, and yeah, it's surreal. Today is Nostalgia Day. It's on my last day in Southern California. I fly back to Atlanta tonight on a red eye, so I'm gonna enjoy today and soak it all in, the good and the bad. But before I leave y'all here, I must give you a moment of silence for this view. So Snappers, I'm in the middle of downtown Fullerton and I just spent not one, not two, but three hours at my favorite coffee shop in the whole city, the Night Owl. Y'all, this, like all of this, this is totally new. Like they didn't have all this sweet wall art when I was here last. It was amazing, look at that. Something that I am finding over and over and over again as I revisit places like years down the road, how things stay the same but how things change. Like there's the new wall art and that's different, but at the same time I got to sit at my old window seat that I would sit at every Tuesday night at like midnight, my clockwork. I'm just going to spend the next hour or so walking around Fullerton. I spent the hours at the coffee shop writing letters to people, so I'm going to go to the post office deliver my sincerest apologies if you do not receive a letter. If you're one of the few who do not receive a letter from me today here in Fullerton. I'm currently on a bridge going over one of the main roads in Fullerton. A bridge that I've driven under many times, but I've never walked across it. It connects a couple buildings uh, in Fullerton College, so I didn't really have a reason to cross this bridge. But it's here. If a bridge is there, it's for crossing, right? This is just a microcosm of um, dream-minded storyteller Tom. New Tom coming to where old Tom used to be and crossing bridges never before crossed. All right, y'all, so after spending a day, a nostalgic day in Fullerton, my old home, I am on the road back to LAX. Gosh, this trip flew by. Just yesterday I was suffering on mile 12 of a half marathon, but it was so good. It went fast, but I saw a lot, did a lot, met a lot of people, reunited with a lot of people in a short time, and kind of ready to go back, honestly. I came, I saw, I wondered. I'm gonna drop off this rental. Nostalgia has been good to me. I'm gonna miss nostalgia. But I'm gonna drop it off and then get a red eye to go back to Atlanta. So don't mind me while I navigate from the 91 to the 5 to the 605 to the 105. Like a boss. Hey y'all, so I'm at LAX. My flight got delayed by a half hour. Lovely. I have yet to eat dinner though, and I bet y'all can figure out what I want to eat. I know In-N-Out exists at this airport. I know it does. I have to find it. I don't care if it's on the other side of the airport, I'm gonna find it. Y'all, I cannot believe this. It's nowhere. I literally did wander to the other side of the airport, and I'm like heartbroken, you guys. I need- I was gonna get one more In-N-Out. I'm so lost. What do I do? I can't. I can't. No. Y'all. It happened. It happened. Whatever, y'all. I didn't really want in and out anyway. <laughs> I'm sitting on the floor against the column, waiting for my flight which is delayed. 
It may seem like the adventure is over, but I'm actually flying overnight to Atlanta and then taking a shuttle bus to Athens. So that's another adventure in itself. And then from Athens back to my home in Watkinsville and then back from Watkinsville back to my home home in Asheville. So still lots of journeying to do. This will be my final send off, I guess, from the City of Angels and from the Golden State. It's been phenomenal. I've loved it. But I'm ready to go back to the Blue Ridge. I miss the beautiful Blue Ridge. I'm coming, Asheville.